<sighs> Caitlin, my name is Caitlin. Okay, I'm going. Hulk Monster is becoming weird. He was normal. He was normal. Now he's crazy. What were you asking, me, ba dum ba dum? What'd you dream about? I had a scary dream yesterday. No, I haven't bought Dark Side of the Moon or The Wall yet. No, I haven't. I'm sorry. I will. Wow. Oh, Ben. Oh. Oh, mistake. Mistake. <laughs> and that was it, I was talking about Ben. I remember when I had my first YouTube dream and it was about Ben. He was walking down the hallway with some guy with dreadlocks. I was like, oh my god, wow. Idiot. You wanna meet an idiot? Hello, how you doing? A lot of people have normal dreams about me. One guy from Norway had a dream that went to Norway, which is crazy because I have a friend who would love to go to Norway. I was like Brad Pitt. Probably. My dream last night, just before I go, my dream last night was really scary. Um, me and my dad were league players, and so was the other guy. But he wasn't himself. He was a um, complete different color, and he had different hair. And we were in a musical, but it was also, we were also watching a really scary movie. Um, that I guess I can only relate it to um, The Ruins, but I've never seen that movie. But the guy was dead, this muscle man, this like, action man was standing there, and his face was just kind of like moving by itself, and something really bad was going to happen, and it was terrifying. And there was stairwells, there were always stairwells in my dream, always circling, <laughs> and office spaces, and I just, it was, it was, but there was a musical going on at the same time. And I always had dreams about musicals or like dancing on stage and I'm always failing because throughout my whole life that's just been a problem. Anyway, I am going to go. I love making ugly faces. Yay! I think he's falling asleep. That means, yeah, okay, cool. Good for, good for us. Oh, I have to see Vertigo. I saw movies I have to see. In fact, there's a movie I have to see right now, and that's why I'm going to go. Okay, Sebastian, Simon, can we please talk somehow about making... No, he's saying make the phone call to the guy. really need help. Caitlin, Caitlin. Salad. Seventy-three people. Oh my god! Why the hell are seventy-three people watching me? Are they high? Look at all these guests. Holy shit! Oh my god! There are so many guests. What are you guys doing? Are you guys touching yourself? Are you guys touching yourself? Bots? Are they bots, really? Well, I don't want any bots. Somebody is making bots. Don't. You don't have to because it's not important. I'm on the front page? No, I'm not. <laughs> that excites me. <laughs> okay, it was exciting for me, okay, because I said, how, look how red I'm getting us up. <laughs> no, I didn't record that. Somebody else did. Oh my god, look at it. I'm just so embarrassed. 
Because when I talk to you guys, it's like just talking to a bunch of crazy people. But when there's like all these, <laughs> so look, whenever I get embarrassed, I start to uh, get tears in my eyes. It's like the time when um, I was in a uh, Michael's restaurant in New York City uh, for work, and um, uh, what's his name? Liam Neeson was in the in the thing, and. Um, and then the guy likes me or something. So the guy was like, hey, I'll introduce you. And I was like, no! Oh my god! And I started to get all red and I put myself in the eye and I started to cry. And he was like, Caitlin, get yourself together. And I was like, turn around. And I went, I'm a little girl in a big city! <laughs> and I walked out. <laughs> so I get, I get excited easily. Hold on. There I am! Superstar! <laughs> you know, this is the crazy thing, is that when I was a kid, when I was 17, this stuff I was just like, oh, okay, sure. And then now it's kind of just like, whoa, this is so fucked up. And I'm sorry. You're allowed to swear on the front page. Okay, cool. I know I'm 20 years old and I'm getting excited about this. Because it's numbers. This is the difference, you see? Numbers, and then there's actual, proper, real. It's difference. Yes, math. Math's exciting. The only reason why I'm so attracted to math is because I could never understand it. I mean, you kind of never understand a man, they're always more attractive. I had the hugest crush on a man I could never understand this year. That ended badly and embarrassingly, but, um, then there was better people, but still. Men are a mystery. They say women are a mystery, but some men are very, very hard to know. Well, I'm going to talk to Seb and Simon, and we're going to talk about how exactly you advertise your show on the front page. I was leaving, and the worst part about me is that part of me just like doesn't want to leave because I'm like, but I'm on the front page. You can't leave. But I remember well, uh, last night when I finished the blog TV chat and I came back on at ten to see if you guys were still talking, and you were, you crazy weirdos. I love you. And um, what's her name? What's her name? Uh, go baby! I can't believe I've got a name. Jill! Jill, who was actually really excited to see last time I saw her, which was weird, because usually we think that we both hate each other, which we don't. And I was actually genuinely excited to see her, which is interesting. And, um, Jill Hannah, yeah, and she was on, and I was like, this is really boring. <laughs> Nothing against her, there's just, there wasn't any music in the background. She was having a normal, casual conversation with her listeners, which is perfectly calm. And I'm sure it's about an interesting topic, but like, I'm not excited by normal things, so everything has to be like, oh shit, like that, like Brooke is, I think that's why I'm friends with Brooke, and she's going to be here soon, can you imagine the craziness, and Brooke and I get together, and we're like, what up, she's going to come in, and she's going to be like, hey, my name's Brooke, no, 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 but you're not just going to walk out, it's going to be fantastic. Oh my gosh, like, I know, I just spazzed in the front page, yes, everything's glorious. Yeah, she's coming here, she's coming to live in New York City. So it's Luke, Sarah, Caitlin, and Brooke. That is the most insane amount of internet people I've ever known. Oh my gosh, isn't Stephen from Steen Kel so funny? Did everybody see his Twitter post? Is he on here? His Twitter post today was so cute. Why do, why do I, what, 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 what does he say? Why do people keep asking me and, me and Kelly to do a video on sexual awareness? It's the most funny thing because... Steven. And then there's Kelly. Steven is... And then Kelly is... Steven. Kelly. <laughs> 